is live in Lamont. She's been out there all morning long with an update. Lauren, what can you tell us right now? Good morning, Mike and Aaron. In just the last few minutes, we've spoken with officials who are telling us that this started as a routine traffic stop for a vehicle code violation. That's when the suspect fled out of his vehicle and started shooting at the at the sheriff while he was running from them. Now, take a look behind me. We are on the cusp of the actual perimeter that's been blocked off. The headquarters for where they're trying to strategize what to do is right here behind me. They've got these major roads blocked off. Multiple sheriffs are on scene. SWAT team is within the neighborhood and officials are telling us they're doing yard to yard searches through these neighborhoods looking for this suspect and apparently they did come in contact with the suspect around 1145 last night. He was in one of the yards and that's when it became a shootout. We actually have one of our crews is on the other side of the perimeter. They're there with the SWAT team with the snipers and they're telling us that around 1145 they heard shots fired. They even heard a loud blast that sounded even more than a gunshot. Now as you can see right now now, traffic is blocked off here on Main Street. Cars are being rerouted, and if you're trying to get into work today, you're going to have to find a different route. We spoke with officials who are telling us that they don't know how soon this is going to be open. Helicopters were in the air earlier. Right now, this entire thing is just a very fluid situation. Things are changing every minute as they go yard to yard searching for the suspect. For now, try to find different routes as you're headed into work, and we will continue to work to bring you more details. Reporting in Lamont, Lauren Titus, 23 ABC.